next time. Where's the dot, boy? Huh? <laughs> Creatives, how are you? Welcome back to the Nerd Creative channel, Build the Back to the Future DeLorean, Part 3. In this video, we'll be completing issue 28 of the build. And as before, we have the components and we have the magazine. Let's have a look through the magazine. Okay. Another great graphic on the front there. Um, we have the components that will be going into this build and the screws. There we go, step-by-step -step instructions of what happens in this build. Then we have a feature about the film, the hit, the hit of the summer, which it is, Pill Rider, which was used in Back to the Future 2 and 3. And we've got more features on the film and we've got uh, Martin McFly doing his Johnny Be Good thing and Thomas F. Wilson who plays Biff. And we also get to see what's in issue 30 which will feature in the next video and as before we get a breakdown of everything that will be built in this section Put the magazine aside. This is quite a big section here. Look at this in 29. So as before we'll do our prep work. This is a very big section as you can see. Just rise that part And get our sections out. So we have our DM screws here. And we have this section here, which is let's get these screws out as well. And we have our BM screws, and we just prize this out. This is, this is quite held in place. Let's just prize this out. Very heavy, very heavy. So we'll lay our components out as they feature in the magazine. So let's just have a look at the magazine. There we go. So we just turn this over. Turn it around. Section here. We've got our screws here. We just lay them out to make sure we've got everything that is in this section of the build. We've got our screwdrivers, we've got our screws. We're ready to go. We have the car back in shot as well, because this component is going to fit onto the car. And the piece that we're going to assemble is this chassis piece here. It's very big, it's very heavy, and it sits under the car. So I'm going to slide that under the car and it will mount up here just fit it in place turn it around and just fit it in place so that will sit here and it will be held by screws 
So we need two DM screws to fit the chassis piece, the chassis plate into place. So we've got two screws here. This will make our car look even different. So put screw in place. I'm going to move the car forward slightly so that we're completely in shot because we're going to put our screws here and here. So we need to lift up the chassis plate there it's in place and we've got to make sure that these line up as well all these holes line up so I'm just going to hold the chassis plate in place and put the first screw in there that screw is not playing ball Okay, let's drop it in and start to attach the chassis plate to the car. I'm slightly lifting the car up to do this so that I know that the, the two sections are being screwed together. Second screw. And I'm lifting the car up slightly so that the two pieces do screw together. Sorry, I just knocked the camera there. Okay. I'm just tighten this first screw up now. Lifting the car up slightly. There. That's the chassis plate in place. If you remember in the previous video we worked on this here which is the radiator assembly and now we're working on the chassis plate so the next thing we need to do is we need to put four DM screws one here one here one here and one, sorry, one here, one here, one here, and one here. So we'll get our DM screws out again, and we need four of them. So one, two, three. Let's just separate them. There's our four DM screws, and it will actually make the chassis plate more secure. So let's put these in place. Second screw. I'm lifting the car up slightly so that the screw pulls the two parts together. I'm going to tighten this one up now. And lift the car up slightly. And we'll do the two screws on the other side. This one here. And as before, I'm going to lift the car up slightly so that the two sections do go together. And the final screw. Lift the car up again. There, that's the gear on. So what we need to do is, we need to turn the car over.
holding the metal frame in place because we need to attach this centre plate and that needs to sit here there's a little nub there just to indicate which way around it goes to secure that together with four sorry two bm screws which we got in this in this section so we'll get a couple of bm screws out and we'll put the rest away and we'll we're just going to attach one screw here and one screw sorry one screw here and one screw here we're not going to do these uh, in this section so let, let's put this screw in just going to make sure the two pieces are sitting together second screw in there on the other side those two screws there in tight. I'm going to flip the car over just put the wheel back there as you can see this the chassis piece is in place it's completely transformed the car now right thank you for watching uh, for joining me in this video and I'll see you in the next video wait a minute wait a minute doc uh, are you telling me that you built a time machine out of a DeLorean